Hi guys, welcome to my channel. This video is about alpha and beta testing. The content of this video Alpha testing, beta testing and sample questions Alpha and beta testing are two stages of acceptance testing. If you would like to know more about acceptance testing, you can watch a video on my channel. It is called Test Levels. Alpha testing is testing by potential users or an independent test team at the developer's site. It is a form of internal acceptance testing. Uh, beta testing is a form of external ac acceptance testing. It is done after alpha testing and it is testing by potential users or existing users on their location under real-world working conditions. In this case, user can install software if needed, use it and report defects that were found. Alpha and beta testing are usually performed on commercial of the shelf software. Um, this software uh, was developed for mass market. Here you can see similarities and differences between alpha and beta testing. Uh, what are similar? So, uh, uh, both uh, alpha and beta testing are stages of acceptance testing. Uh, they are done to get feedback from potential or existing customers before the software product is released to the market. Uh, and it is usually done on commercial of the shelf software, software from a market. And uh, also developers are not involved in um, alpha and beta testing. This is the similarities. Uh, uh, also, some differences. Uh, first, alpha testing that is done, then beta testing. Alpha testing performed by potential users or independent testing team. Beta testing is performed by potential or existing users. So, independent testing team is not involved in beta testing. So, for alpha testing, um, potential users or independent testing team, they come to the office of the company uh, which uh, develops the software and they are test doing testing there. For beta testing, uh, potential or existing users, uh, they uh, test the, the software on their own locations. It can be home, school, a cafe, uh, any place. Um, they uh, download software if needed and um, do their testing. Uh, then they report the defects uh, which were found and uh, share their feedback. Practice. Which of the following statements are true? Uh, beta testing is performed by independent testers. Uh, this is not true. Uh, alpha testing can be performed by independent testers. Independent testing team uh, is not involved in uh, beta testing. Then, uh, alpha testing is performed by potential users after they bought the software on the market. That's false because um, mm, alpha testing is done before the software is released to the market. Uh, so, um, it's not true. Then, beta testing can be performed by potential users at their home. Yeah, this is true. Beta testing can be performed uh, at um, um, user's location, any place. Uh, alpha testing is performed by developers on their site. This is false because developers are not involved uh, in alpha testing and also uh, they are not involved in beta testing. So the, um, the correct answer is D, where um, the third statement is true. Thank you for watching. If you are interested in software testing videos, please subscribe. See you in my next videos. Bye bye.